Tucked in the hills of Berry Creek in Butte County, complete with their own lake, Camp Okaizu was once a welcome retreat. Camp Okaizu is a magical space, a magical camp um, for families affected by cancer. Um, and it's a place for the whole family to come, to find respite, connection, community, support, love, and to have fun. But decades of memories made here were reduced to rubble in the unforgiving path of the North Complex fire in 2020, something longtime camper, 17-year-old Julian Carter, remembers like yesterday. I kind of cried for a while. That was, that was kind of tough, and I'm sure it was tough for a lot of people because, you know, Barry Creek was... That, that was Okaizu. He had been visiting since he was in middle school after learning about his brother's cancer diagnosis. Before coming to camp, I was a lot more closed off and I was like, I bottled all my feelings because I didn't really know who to talk to about it. But after coming here for the first time, uh, I, I met a bunch of people who were very similar to me, so it was a lot easier to open up. With no place left to go, that's when the Taylor Family Foundation stepped in to help. Well, they lost their camp, and I know how critical camp was to them because we used to fund it. And I couldn't imagine the families not having that service for themselves and for their children. They opened the doors of Camp Arroyo in Livermore for two weeks at no charge to Okaizu, its campers, or their families. The beauty of camp is that it, it can, the magic can happen anywhere. It's really the kindness, the love, the community that makes camp camp. While Camp Okaizu might be in a different location, the essence of Camp Okaizu is following these campers wherever they go. Berry Creek did mean a lot to everybody, but what matters most is that we're still all able to be here together, and that's what makes this so special. In Livermore, it doesn't matter where camp is, the magic will follow. Lena Howland, ABC 7 News.